Down near the southern tip of Africa lies the South African city of Cape Town. It's regarded as one of the world's most beautiful cities and is a highly sought after tourist destination with world famous attractions like its beaches, the waterfront and of course Table Mountain. Cape Town is also the gateway to the renowned Cape Winelands where over 95% of South Africa's wines are produced. They are among the most respected wines in the world and there's quite a story to tell about them. Or rather, there are two stories to tell. The one is about making better wines. The other is about making wines better. It's really no surprise that South African wines are so highly regarded. After all, we have over 350 years of rich winemaking history to draw on. It's a history that includes Dutch, German, Italian and French influences, embracing all the best traditions of old world wines. But our winemaking industry is also young enough to explore more modern new world styles. The other factor behind the quality of our wines is the extraordinary geography and climate of the region. The Cape Winelands fall within the Cape Floral Kingdom, the world's smallest but richest floral kingdom. There are more plant species in this southwestern corner of South Africa than there are in the entire Northern Hemisphere. This natural wealth is a result of the region's unique landscape. It has the oldest viticultural soils in the world. It embraces two oceans, the Atlantic to the west and the Indian to the east both of which bring sea breezes, mist and fog, and it has various mountain ranges, slopes and valleys, which offer micro, macro and meso climates, with different degrees of sunshine, shade and shelter. These influences make for a spectacularly diverse range of environments and conditions. It presents endless winemaking opportunities and offers winemakers an incredible palette with which to express themselves. To match the sites, there's also a wide range of grapes. We have a uniquely South African red variety, Pinotage, which is a cross between Pinot Noir and Hermitage, and there are more Chenin Blanc vineyards in South Africa than any other country. Add a number of other major varieties and dozens of recently introduced grapes, along with some very old vines, and you have the makings of extraordinary wines, enjoyed and admired throughout South Africa and around the world. If our history and environment have helped us produce such good wines, it's only right that we should think of our future and look after our natural resources. For this, we take our cue from the Tamsan, the indigenous people of South Africa. 80,000 years back, they were the original environmentalists, living in harmony with nature and taking from the earth only what it could replenish. The South African wine industry is taking its responsibilities seriously. Thanks to the Biodiversity and Wine Initiative, more of our wineland has been set aside for conservation than the total area under vineyard. And almost all wine producers farm according to established guidelines to manage water resources and ensure sustainable growing methods. Of course, it's not enough just to be earth friendly. Our producers need to be people friendly too. Through organizations like the Wine Industry Ethical Trade Association and the Fair Trade Foundation, investment in programs and infrastructure constantly improves working and living conditions. It's significant that South Africa has the most fair trade wines in the world. These principles have vastly expanded our definition of quality. While since 1973, the Wine of Origin scheme has certified the origin, vintage and variety of wines, the new Integrity and Sustainability seal takes the concept of good wine even further. Introduced in 2010, this world first guarantees the wine's environmental and social responsibility credentials according to measurable, auditable criteria, while also making it possible to trace the wine all the way back to the vineyard.
So by considering the consequences of how we work and thinking ahead for the next generations, we're not just making better wine, we're also making wine better. These are some of the reasons South African wine is up there with the world's best. We're doing good things by considering our environment and by embracing the variety in it. There's variety beyond our natural environment too. If you visit us here in the Cape Winelands, you'll see diversity all around you. After all, we're not called the Rainbow Nation for nothing. Our wine routes are set in constantly changing but always breathtaking landscapes. Along them you'll find a plethora of different people, cultures, languages and histories. You'll find mountains and oceans, distractions for nature lovers and luxury lovers, thrill seekers and relaxation seekers. You'll find some of the world's best hotels and guest houses, spas, golf courses and restaurants, and of course, an abundance of vineyards, wineries and estates. It's well worth a visit, but if that's not possible, you can always enjoy some of our wines. They're not just good, they're better.